Hello guys and welcome to my first video on Minecraft. Um, today I will be showing you guys how to make a crafting table. So, what you will need, you will need uh, just one lava bucket, one diamond pickaxe, one, one di a couple diamonds, obsidian, wooden planks, sugar canes, paper, and books. So, the sugar cane paper, you, I'm just going to show you guys how to make books if you don't know how, and bookcases and stuff like that. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, so first, what you'll need, you'll need obsid obsidian, my bad. So you just take lava and just put it in a ditch or something. And then you need a water bucket, so I'll just find a water bucket. I'm in creative mode right now, I'm not on survival because someone deleted, someone, like something happened to my survival mode, so I had to delete it, so I had to start all over. So I'm just showing you guys clicking creative to get started. So then you put it on the side right here, right here, or right there, or right there, just to make obsidian. So you just put it, let it go over. And then, of course, if you were on survival, your bucket would have emptied. But I'm on creative, so it didn't. So, and then to, like, pick it up, just do the same, just go over to it, where you clicked, and then right-click like you would put it down, and then you pick it up. So then, diamond pickaxe, you need to break the obsidian. It's the only thing you could break obsidian with. So yeah, that's what you need, oh fucker. But I am in creative, so like I said, it would break easily. So then you would get create, so then you would get obsidian. So then you go to a crafting table, and then you take the sugar cane to make paper, you do it three across, and then you have paper. To make a book, you do it three up, and then you have a book. You do need three books for one book shelf, so I suggest you do that. But I'll show you at the end for the bookshelf first. Let's make the uh, enchantment table. So the enchantment table layout will be this obsidian three on the uh, bottom below, one in the middle. Then you take two diamonds, put them on the side, and then you need one book for the top. And there's your enchantment table. So, but then if you want to make a large enchantment table to make like better to like see like if I put this in this is a small enchantment table you can't go over like maybe I think seven or something but then if you did make a large enchantment table it'd be easier so then to make a large enchantment table that's when you need the bookshelf so to make a bookshelf all you do is three books and then wooden planks the rest and then there's your bookshelf so you could just keep doing that and then Whoops, my bad. And then you'll eventually have a bunch of bookshelves. Let's just go seven to make sure. And so, once you have a bunch of bookshelves, then all you need to do is really put them around it, and then you'll you'll like make a large enchantment table. So, but I don't think I made enough. You need a lot to make a large enchantment table. I don't know, but I usually cover it up like that, but you can make bigger space. I don't like how small it is right now. It's, it feels too small. And I think it will be large, so yeah. Oh, never mind. Nope, it's not large. Uh, I think it has to be a little bigger. But yeah, that's how you make bookshelves, so let me just spawn some bookshelves because I am in creative so I don't need to make them a bunch of bookshelves all right so then you need to make it large I think that's why it didn't really work so make it like really big and make like one opening like that and then just keep doing that oh, I'm sorry for the I know my quality is really bad because uh, my fraps isn't working fraps is the if you guys don't know fraps is what I use to make like the videos it's like the well it's like the camera in the computer so it's not working so I just had to use an ordinary camera so sorry about that but I'm pretty sure you guys would still see it well and then you know just close it off and then just to be sure you should want to put a door and that just makes it look better too you see and you go in go to the enchantment table put it in and then see, it goes up to like 22, 31, 35, it goes really high. So then if you upgrade them, they're like insanely good. Like look how good that is, sharpness three, knockback two, fire aspect two. So then, see how good it is. 
to spawn something. We'll spawn a zombie. Whoops, my bad. Where's the zombie? I don't think I'm yes. Alright, now it's fine. See him eat them on fire and you kinda kill them in one shot. Or two. So they're highly effective when you make them like that. That's what I like about them. So yeah. Um if this video if you guys have any questions. Just leave them a comment, please like this video, and then, yeah, hope you enjoyed it. Bye.